Well, today it's about getting that hive equalized. And that's today's video. Uh, it's been a challenge uh, since the last video I did here, which was yesterday, but you didn't get to see it. It was too many bees and I didn't have the proper gear. And what I mean by that, uh, we need to get smoker fuel. Uh, and that's important uh, because uh, if you don't, there's a lot of bees and you'll wind up uh, in trouble. You know, with a lot of bees on you. And also burlap bags. I cut these up into small pieces. Uh, I gotta look here. Here we go. And uh, that's what I have here. And I use these uh, for the smoker. But besides that, today is the day to go in this hive. Uh, that will be a challenge. Uh, and I have some bad frames in there. I know I do. Uh, remember, it's old equipment. It's about you know, over three or four or five years old. Uh, and I'm uh, putting some frames together and getting prepped up to uh, fix the hive. Which is February. We're uh, towards the end of February. It's like 22nd of February. And we have drones. So uh, we're going to be uh, getting in that hive. And that's today's video. All right. Let's go. Okay, we're gonna go in here and see what we got. You wanna go real slow with these frames. You don't want them to break, you know they're real old. You want to take your time on this. So, you know, we got a little bit of honey there. I'm gonna go ahead and put this down here. I gotta make it like it was. We're gonna go in here and see what we got. They're bringing in nectar. Look at that. They're bringing in nectar. There's, there's a drone there. They got a couple of drones running around eating. And we got some honey right there. Look at that. So I'm going to put this to the side. Uh, and that's what's going on here. We'll look and see if any queen cups are in here. Any queens, any any makings of that because you don't want that to happen you don't want to hurt your queens so you want to look around because you don't want them to make a queen got some honey got a lot of bees got drones eating so we know we got a lot of food Last 
time I was in this hive, it was real busy. I mean, they were all over me. But now they're calm. Got a little smoke here. But that's the deal. How about you get to see it right there? How about that? We're gonna smoke them a little bit, not too much. Let's keep them from flying. You never got a close up like this before. I know there's other guys, but they don't do this. They really show you the real stuff that's going on. I know some people do and some people don't. Well, don't forget, I got old equipment. I'm still going in it. Uh, and that's what you got to do. Look at that. I might be able to get lucky on this one. I don't want to hurt no bees. They'll come after me. Ah, here we got one here. Look at that. Look at that. Look at all that brood. Look at the brood pattern on that. Huh? I want to make sure it's clean here. Look at that brew pattern. Let's get some light. See that? That's what you call a good queen. I mean, she is rolling here. I mean, she's nonstop. Now, I don't want to keep around because I don't want to lose my queen. But look at that. Look at that. See that? Now, look how many bees I got now. You know they're going to swarm. It's just a matter of time. But I got to check and see. Oh, let me get this out of here. Let's make sure there's no queen on here. Mm -hmm. queen out here. I'm going to make sure she's not laying over here. I don't want to lose her. We're going to the next one. I don't really have to, but I'm doing it. I want to double check some stuff. As you know, I want to check for queens, any, any queens going on here. Or any possibilities of them swarming early in the season. And they will do that. You know, bees do what they want to do, not what you want them to do. Now, I know you guys might know that, but it's another thing when you have to deal with it. <laughs> More. Look at this. They're getting ready to have another family. Look at that. More. I mean, I got tons of bees, and we're talking February. This is February. This is not even March. We're still in winter, everybody. Look at that. Oh, that queen's hiding somewhere, wouldn't you say? Oh, I won't be able to find her. So... Look at this. I want to get rid of queen cups. I don't need those cups. I don't need any of it. I got a good queen right now. I don't need that more. Not like this. So we're going to do an inspection on this. We're doing an inspection, taking a look here. And uh, that's all, folks. I'll move this to the side here. I got one out. I know how to place them back. It's that, uh, they're real calm right now. I like calm bees. I know everybody does. Oh, boy, this is a good one.
can see they'll start making. See that? One, two, three. They're starting three already. Well, I ain't gonna let that happen. They're getting ready to. I won't let them do. Look at that. Now I'll slide all these over back the way it was. I only got one out. I mean, I got two out, but I can figure that out. Rush, oh, shake them, shake them, shake them. Come on, girls, be easy on me. I know I'm shaking your life up a little bit. But don't shake mine yet. Come on. We got a lot of drone being made here. Lot, oops, what's that fire? We won't do that for you. So, that's it, more drones. Hey, you want to check? Because it'll happen. They'll throw the queen on you before you know it, your hive's gone. And you'll say, wow, it's, it's March, it's early. No, hold on. See, when they want to do it, they do it. Now, I don't want to hurt no queen. She's here somewhere, but I ain't going to try to find her. She's doing really well. I don't want to mess everybody's brood up. I don't want to kill me. Well, let's go ahead and put this back. Put them back the same way you got them. Oh, God. Come on, girls. Don't, don't beat me up. I ain't hurting you. I'm taking care of you. Remember this one? Remember that, right? So what we're gonna do, we're gonna bring this back over because that's not the one. Remember, you want these nurse bees. All right, girls. Got this one. Got a beetle. I've seen one beetle in here. See the propolis? Look at the propolis. So now we're going to open them here. Overwinter bottom. So 
So they're mostly on the top. So they got room. Let's look inside. One already. So when the frame breaks, you go on the other side and you go from there. You know. You know, I'm gonna have to fix that. I don't want to hurt no trees. And they're not doing nothing here. Dude. So there's nothing here. So they've been building on the top. And uh, they're putting their uh, pollen up on these hives. Hard to see in the dark, sorry. So I gotta go through these. So we got some brood here also. I think she's laying down here. I think the queen's down here. Let me see if I can spot her. I'm running out of daylight here. I didn't mark my queen. I don't mark them. I just make sure they're doing heavy production. Imagine uh, checking, you know, 200 high of the queens. I mean, you could, but yeah, it's a waste of time sometimes. It depends on how much you're spending on queens. Still laying brood here and it got pollen on the side. Boy, bending down there, bending down a little bit. Something else. These are kind of low. Uh, well. Even when you check all the hives, you never know. They hide these babies. Look at the drones in here. Look at that. Uh. 
Well, they have their pollen on the bottom. So all their pollen's on the bottom of these hives. Uh, That's the busted one. They'll clean this out. I know it's ugly, but they'll re they'll redo this. I'm not gonna do anything like that. There's no time. I got these, it'll work. That's all I have anyway. Okay, and now we're going to treat them. <coughs> That's the treatment for the beginning of the season. Then we'll do a mite check eventually, but that's it pretty much. Now i got to go ahead and stack these back. On this road here this this road is busy uh this is my particular location but i you know hope the other one's gonna be this way but that's what we got going i'm sweating a little bit talking fast let me slow down it's a lot doing the bees sometimes you know when uh, you're back in the beginning of the season and you're starting out again it's back to the getting in shape mode you know so here we have so now i'm going to put the excluder uh, they look really good. I don't see any signs of swarming, but I did see some drones So I, that did alarm me and when you see drones you get alarmed. That's just something that I do And I don't want to get out of this. So let's get these girls out of here. I'm gonna squash these babies Come on girls out the way
Well, guys, you've seen it here at Russian River Bees, California Russian River Bees. That's how it goes at the beginning of the season. You might get an early swarm, and maybe you won't, but you won't know until you check your bees. Thanks for watching, California Russian River Bees. Like, comments, if I, if I have comments on there. Still working on the YouTube channel. As you know, it's work in progress, and we're waiting to get funded, hopefully. If not, what are you gonna do? And we have to find other ways to get resources. See, commercial beekeeping is not that simple. First, you gotta get the money. First, you gotta get the skills, and then you gotta find the money. Remember that. If you wanna be a commercial beekeeper, uh, it takes a lot of money. Uh, it does. You can start out with 50 hives, but you know, it, it, the time you go through those hives and lose hives and uh, go through, you know, losses and then swarms, you know, you gotta have a lot of bees so you can have a backup. Yeah, like more bees where you can come in and take care of the uh, take care of the location that's doing bad. Uh, there was no equalization to be done here also, so I didn't have to do any equalization on this hive. Uh, so far, so good, I think. Uh, we'll check again, but not right now. So that's it here at California Russian River Bees. Thank you again for watching. Comments and likes are really appreciated. And thank you again for watching. And you make it a great day. Bye-bye.